The depth of water in feet at a certain place in a lake is modeled by this function W right there. That's the depth of water. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's an M. Night Shyamalan movie. The graph of y equals w of t is shown for t is in between 0 and 30, where t is the number of days since the first day of a month. What are the intervals of t on which the depth of water is increasing at a decreasing rate? All right, okay. First off, if the slope is positive, it's increasing. But we don't just want positive slopes because we see positive slopes everywhere. They want increasing at a decreasing rate. What's the difference? Well, increasing at an increasing rate, we'll just say increasing, increasing, looks like this, where as you increase, it gets steeper along the way. We don't want that. What we're looking for is increasing at a decreasing rate where it's still increasing, but as it increases, it kind of levels out. So this is what we want. So it's like, concave down but in the upward trend. Now the only concave, so this is increasing but at an increasing rate, don't want you. This is increasing at a decreasing rate, so we do want you. Decreasing, this right here is increasing at an increasing rate. So the area that we want, the only spot that we want is this concave down but increasing spot right here, which is in between 3 and 6. So the intervals of t on which the depth of water is increasing at a decreasing rate is a, where it's the interval 3, 6, only nothing else. Okay? Done so.